of the Owen tournament. We didn't talk about last week because it was really confusing. We were recording on a Wednesday last week. Um, we had matches going on on Dynamite. We had matches going on on Rampage and fucking Collision. So now we at least can, I can actually get to the final because we talk about who's going to win. On the men's side, it's Brian Danielson taking on either Jay White or Hangman. That's happening on Collision. So obviously we're not going to know the results on this show. And um, Willow Nightingale versus Mariah May. Rampage spoiler. I I didn't even. I'm watching the show, but I'll forget I even said that when, when I watch the show. Um, <laughs> but Willow versus Mariah. Brian versus Jay White or Hangman. Sal, who's winning the Owens? All in. Uh, I was gonna say Brian Danielson because you know his kind of sort of farewell tour, but I don't know with Hangman Page now involved, I'm leaning more toward the Hangman Adam Page winning the men's tournament. Yeah, I, you know what's funny is I actually was thinking the same thing. Uh, the only thing I see, I need to know what the hell is going on with Nigel. If we're doing Brian and Nigel at all in, then Hangman wins the Owen. You have the Hangman swerve history. But if you're not doing Brian and Nigel, Brian's going to win the Owen. Like, he has to. Like, it's one of those, it's weird. Like, I need to know what's going on with that. But my official pick is Hangman. But I, I don't know. Um, Dad, what do you think for the men's? I got to go Hangman. I, I think he's the one that's going to come in and, and take it all this this year only because out of everyone, he's he was the uh, wild card, and he's probably the one that's most healthiest uh, at this time with, I, I don't know, if he, any type of injury that's hankering him or bothering him, but Bryant has those in to put your – body through all that toll and torture and you know it, it, somewhere along the line your body is going to say stop this shit because I can't take it anymore so if he goes out and he loses at least he goes out knowing that he gave it 100% very very true um the other side Willow Nightingale Mariah May common sense says Mariah I don't know if Tony Khan has common sense. So, Sal, your thoughts? <laughs> um, hey, this can go either way because uh, they're both involved in, you know, storylines that are pretty prominent right now. Uh, Willow being back to back would be kind of cool. Mm -hmm. But set a, precedent, set a precedent, you know. Right. But Mariah, on the other hand. I think she needs that little boost. Maybe set up a a, a a jealousy angle with Tony Storm or something. I don't know. But uh, if I'm going to pick, I feel like um, Chris Statlander is going to screw Willow from being back-to-back -back winner. Um, ah. Tough. The tough one. Yeah. But, uh, so I do. I actually actually like that idea because then you're gonna have Statlander Nightingale at all in and like a street fight. Hold on for a couple seconds. I gotta mute myself. Like I like that idea of having Mariah versus Tony and then Willow versus Statlander in a street fight at all in. So yeah, with Lita, I'll win for Mariah winning this thing for that case. Um Dad, what do you think? I'm gonna go to Willow only because I think if Mariah has this award or this belt and a trophy, I think that's going to cause some jealousy issues between yeah. her and Tony that basically is going to probably cause a rift. Well, but and, the is, Tony is the reason why she's in this match anyway. Tony's yeah, the in the tournament. Like, if, you're, if you're sticking to her character, it's, it's everything is focused is on Tony, and if you take the focus off of her and now put it on Mariah, that's where the jealousy issue is going to come to the head, and it's not going to be comfortable with Tony in that setting. So, I mean, if you want Tony and Ryan to stick together, then basically the best bet is for her not to win the one. Fair enough. Fair enough. 